This is Ari Everett for uh, Learning Target 2 A, B, and C for Demo and Quiz 1 for Professor Cody Anderson in the fall of 2023, CSC 120. Let's work through this problem here. We want to show this number here that they've given to us from Desi Base 10 into binary into the three um, signed uh, forms here. So sign magnitude is very simple. They take the leading digit to change it to the quote unquote negative. So you take 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 0, 0, and that sign magnitude is 1, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 0, 0. Moving on for one complement is we just flip it. So let's take the 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 0, 0, flipped. Each one of these is down, is um, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 0, 1, 1. And I'll remember the base twos here. And then twos complement, uh, the shortcut to this trick is, you have, normally you would have to add one, but instead of doing that, you can start from the right, the far right, and drop down the same thing until the first one and then flip the remainder. All right, for 2a now, I'm going to speed things up. I have already created the problems and just explaining my work here. The last video was uh, far over the nine minute max and I had to speed things up. So here we go. Uh, hexadecimal addition, we have to remember this is a base 16 symbols. So zero, two, one, five, and that's when it repeats. So when we take D, I wrote this little table over here to remind myself, D is 13. Oh, I'm sorry, that was the uh, example problem. C, 42C plus 5F6. And C is 12, I've written that as a reminder here, plus six is 18, um, but minus the 16, that means it left a remainder of two after it completes that cycle. So we drop the two here and then carry the one. One plus two plus F, which is 15 deci, is going to be 18, and it's the same thing here. Eight minus the 16 base equals the two, so they drop the two, and then you carry, and then four plus five is nine plus one is 10, and 10 up here in our graph is A in hexa. I'll drop down to the um, to the subtraction over here, uh, just to stay on the hexadecimal subtraction. 83C, I'm sorry, let's do A2B minus 5D6, which is what I did. B translates into 11, D and 13, so 11 minus six equals five, that is simple. Two, you need to carry or borrow from the previous digit a one, but it's not a, uh, a 12, this is a one and a two, so you can think of it like, uh, 1, 2, which is the 16 um, base, which is over here, and then uh, the two digit, you add together, and that's 18. So really, you're looking at 18, which is 1 and 2, minus the 13, and that's where we get the 5. Um, this, change, this 8 changes into a 7, minus 5 is 2. Okay, uh, octal, same thing, it's uh, 0 to 7, so you have to remember that, 4, 3, 1, plus, I'm sorry, let's do 4, 3, 2, plus 5, 7, 7. That's two plus seven is nine, and that is two more than our seven, or I'm sorry, our eight, uh, not, uh, one more than our eight base, which is one. You carry the one here, three plus seven plus one is 11, and that is three after our eight base. So we drop the three, carry the one, four plus five plus one is 10, which is uh, one, two octal. Okay, decimal, thank you for throwing us an easy one here. Uh, we do the standard elementary math to get 269. I didn't choose another example, just wanted to make that quick. Unsigned binary here, this is important uh, to know that our, our what uh, form we're in. And so I chose 0011 and 0011 so I can show you how I know how to carry. So one plus one is actually um, two, which is one zero. So you drop that and then you carry the one here. And so on, one 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 is three. And so we know that's one one. So you drop the one and then carry the other one. Uh, this is all zeros plus one and then zero leading zero here. Um, unsigned binary subtraction, it's the same thing here. I chose to do 1010 minus 10100 to do some carries here. Um, 0 minus 0 is 0, 1 minus 0 is 1. 0 minus 1, you carry the 1 to create a 2, um, and then make this a 0, uh, which is a 2, not a 10. So 2 minus 1 is 1, and that represented deci is just 0, 1. So this here, and then the 0 over here. Okay, and now for target 2C, which is um, doing the method of adding the negative in two's complement form when you subtract here. So I changed my numbers to 47 minus 107, and we'll break down decimal here to the left with the divide by two method to get to binary. We leave it as the, um, the, the positive, quote unquote. So 47 all the way down, and then use your uh, MSB to LSB equals 101111, and then you add our leading digits here to make it 8-bit, as it says here in the directions. Okay, and then we want to add the negative. So first, we find the positive 107 or unsigned 107 uh, base decimal system, and we do our divide by two method. 
and then back up with MSB to LSB, which is 1101011, and then the leading zero of for to make it eight bits. And we take the twos complement here, which we know the um, shortcut is making it one, dropping it down uh, the first, from right to left, the first digit, and then flipping everything else. So this one becomes a zero, the zero becomes a one, and so on. We get one zero zero one zero one zero one. And then we bring these down to subtraction or to the addition here where we're adding the negative. So 00101111 plus 10010101. And we do our addition here and we do the carries as we mentioned. Um, and careful to remember that two is one zero in binary and three is one one. That's why when we add the one and the one, it becomes a zero down here, you carry a one. Answer is one one zero 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 one zero zero base two. And how we can complete the, or check our work is we take the two's complement of this, which we know our shortcut gets us zero zero one one and one one zero zero. And that is uh, with the weighted base uh, method gets us 60. So we know that the complement of it was unsigned 60. Now it is quote unquote negative 60. And we chuck it from the original 46 minus 107 deci is negative 60.